You know, I love the holiday season because I always get festive messages left on my answering machine. <laughs> Happy solstice, everybody. <laughs> This is Hillary supporter. I am calling you because I need to put you fuck shits on blast. <laughs> I've had up to here with you people turning my timeline into a dumpster fire. Stop all of this bullshit, okay? All of you diehard ch- chonk Uger, burn <laughs> Bernie bro, whatever people, you're done. You have to leave. If you fuckheads think that getting rid of all the ills of society will stop all the ills of society from happening well sorry you're wrong and you're (laughs) stupid (laughs) I'm only going to say this once because I'm an empathetic nice person with empathy Mm. I would rather pull all my teeth without anesthesia and eat five pounds of broken glass with my bloody gums (laughs) than listen to boiny Sanders and his anti-semitic sexist bestiality <laughs> fuckheaded cult followers spend their whole lives trying to destroy Hillary Clinton's reputation. Despite these tribulations, she's still a huge international celebrity with hundreds of millions of people hanging on her every <laughs> word, okay? <laughs> Sidebar to you, Jimmy Dore, I wouldn't be surprised if you harbored some problematic attitudes towards women, not one bit. <laughs> Surprise. <laughs> Maybe you should take a good hard look at yourself in the mirror. Bernie Sanders set the country back generations because he selfishly ran against Hillary four years ago. So listen up. The reason Hillary is speaking the truth is because Bernie Sanders fucked America. (laughs) And I just like my Twitter account because of you fuck shits and your bestiality. So go fuck yourselves, you idiots. Just as I predicted, all indicators are that this is going to be a very strong and powerful holiday season of lugubrious salutations and merriment. (laughs) You can all just lick my love muscle. (laughs) David Axelrod. (laughs) Rick Perry's next. Alexa, what is the true meaning of Christmas? (laughs) And why? And how? And when? Oh, baby Jesus, with your nose so bright, won't you spot my enemies tonight with the munificent terror of your awesomeness power? Bertie Sanders. Look, I grew up in a working-class family, and we could never afford a tree during Christmas, so we decided to become Jewish. Look, Jimmy, on a different subject, I gave you a holiday present citing your strong endorsement for my Medicare for All program and your strong voice in the fight for social and economic justice. But 20 years ago, you told a joke about a guy who walked into a bar and bet the bartender he could fart the national anthem. So, I'm taking your present back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Bernie unpresents me. <laughs> On the third day of Christmas, my true love gave to me one turtle dove, two geese a land, and, uh, uh, I don't know, Siri... What's third one again? (laughs) Okay, thanks. And a Department of Energy. (laughs) Kevin Spacey left me a message. You don't like your gift? Well, guess what? I don't care. (laughs) You think Christmas is over-commercialized? I don't care. You don't like your racist uncle, I don't care. You don't like me not caring, I don't care about you not liking me not caring. (laughs) Harvey's coming over for crudités. Join us. Shut your goddamn sauce box, okay? (laughs) It is what it is. Ain't none of you or anyone can do about it. I need to ask you a special favor. I need you to do uh, some house painting for me, (laughs) followed by a little carpentry. And some cleanup. <laughs> you got that? <laughs> Here comes Jeb Bush is next. Hello? <laughs> Hello? Is anybody there? <sighs> I'm locked in the basement again. <laughs> and all this time it's not for attention, okay? <laughs> I left my keys upstairs. Oh, here they are. Oh. Well, I guess that means I'm not locked in the basement after all. <laughs> Silly me. Hello? 
<laughs> Jeb Bush is so funny. Oh, here comes Liam Neeson. Jimmy, <laughs> I need you to listen very closely. You're about to be taken. Taken by an overwhelming sense of ennui and hopelessness. <laughs> Merry Christmas, or whatever the fuck it is you observe, you troglodyte. Wait, I take that back. Fuck Christmas and fuck you! <laughs> wow, Liam seems upset. Harrison Ford. Pilot to tower, pilot to tower. <laughs> <laughs> There's a scorpion in the cockpit, please advise. <laughs> Oh, drug Bill O'Reilly's calling for Christmas. Yes. Yeah, I'm an unloved, blotchy face fuckhead with a receding hairline. Please love me because I post pictures of myself with a cute dog right after I post something racist. <laughs> hey, Sean Connery gave me a Christmas message. Jimmy, you can take that bloody drumstick and cram it up your nana's third hatch. <laughs> And I mean that with all due respect. <laughs> <laughs> Become a premium member and get hours of bonus material every week. Go to jimmydorcomedy.com slash join. Also, come see our live shows. We do live shows all the time. We're going to be in Hawaii. Then we're going to Portland, Tempe, Sacramento, San Jose, Miami. Go to jimmydorcomedy.com for a link for all the tickets for all of our live shows. See you soon.